Audio book Math Magic 4 Textbook in Mathematics for Class 4 Page 1 Chapter 1 Titled Building with Bricks Brick Patterns for Jagrati School This is the true story of Jagrati School in Murshidabad, West Bengal. When its building was being made, there was a plan to make brick patterns on the floor and walls. Jamal, Kalu and Piyar were the masons for the brickwork. They wanted to get new ideas for the school building. So they took their other friends to see the old tomb of Murshid Kuli Khan. A photograph of the old tomb of Murshid Kuli Khan has been given here on page number 1. This building has a big floor with about 2,000 beautiful brick patterns. These were made by masons long back, about 300 years ago. There are three pictures given here on page number 1. These pictures are from the old tomb of Murshid Kuli Khan. Different bricks have been arranged in these pictures in different patterns. Identify how the bricks are arranged in these five flow patterns. Page number 2 Here on page number 2, there are three different pictures of three different brick patterns. Which floor pattern do you like the most? Dash Have you seen such patterns anywhere? The masons came back excited. Jamal said, Ah! Oh. In those days, they had made so many interesting brick patterns. We had forgotten these. Let us make some nice designs on the floor of this school. Each mason made a different brick pattern. The school is proud to have such a beautiful building. Children play and sing on it and also make new patterns themselves. On page number 2, there are two pictures given. In the first picture, many school students are sitting on the floor. The second picture is of the different brick patterns made on the floor. Page number 3 There are 11 pictures of 11 different brick patterns. They have been marked as A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K. Which pattern is made in a circle? In which pattern can you show mirror halves? Draw a line. Now, you draw some new floor patterns. Page number 4 How to draw a brick? There are two photos of the same brick. In one photo, we can see only one face of the brick. In the other, we can see three faces. Circle the photo showing three faces. How many faces in all does a brick have? Dash Is any face a square? Draw the smallest face of the brick. Which of these are the faces of a brick? Mark a tick. There are different shapes given here along with the question. You have to identify which of these are the faces of a brick. <clears throat> which of these is a drawing of a brick? Mark a tick. There are different shapes drawn here on page number 4. You have to identify which of these drawings is a brick. Make a drawing of this box to show three of its faces. There is a box given on page number 4. Identify this box and its faces. Can you make a drawing of a brick which shows four of its faces? Page number 5 A wall that will not fall. One day Munia and Zainab were playing with bricks and making their walls. 
each made a different wall. There are two different pictures given on page number five. These two pictures are of a wall made by Zainab and Munia. Zainab says her wall will not fall easily. Masons too do not put bricks one on top of the other, as Munia has done. What do you think? Which wall will be stronger? Look for walls where you can observe different brick patterns. Identify the walls where you can observe different brick patterns. Different wall patterns. Here are photos of three kinds of brick walls. Can you see the difference in the way the bricks are placed? There are three pictures given here on page number five. With three different kinds of brick walls. Now match the photo of each wall with the correct drawing here. Page number six. Looking through a brick jali. The masons who built Jagrati School had also made different jali patterns on the walls. There are two pictures given here on page number six. In both these pictures. Different jali patterns have been given on different walls. How many different jali patterns can you identify in these two photos? Page number seven. This is a drawing of another beautiful jali. There is a drawing of a beautiful jali made on a brick wall given here on page number seven. Now. Color some bricks red and make your own jali patterns in the wall drawn here. On page number seven, there is a black and white wall made of bricks given. You have to color some of the bricks in red to make your own patterns. Can you identify the window or jaroka in this photo of the school? On page number seven. There is a photograph of a school jharokha or window given. Can you identify the jharokha in this picture? Now, draw some jharokha patterns on the wall here. You can shade it black. Here, on page number seven, a red brick wall has been drawn. You have to color some of these bricks in black color to make a jharokha. Page number eight. There are four different pictures of four different jali patterns given. The first picture is of a jali from a library building in Kerala. Identify how the edge of the bricks is used to make a triangle in the wall. Have you identified bricks that look like triangles? Observe the bricks around the tree. In the third photograph given here, can you identify the arch in this photo? This is from a school in Faisalabad. Find out. In picture number four, on page number eight, there is an arch made as part of a brick wall. Identify other arches around you and draw them. Page number nine. Have you seen arches in a bridge? Where else have you seen an arch? Dash. There's a picture of an arch under the bridge given here on page number nine. A special arch. In this photo from Orcha, identify how the arch is made. It has a nice name. Ghungat Wali Mehrab, the arch with a veil. There is a photograph given here on page number nine of a small house in Orcha. This house has an arch above its main gate. Isn't the jali of this window beautiful? It is made of thin bricks. Have you ever identified thin bricks? Observe around. Page number ten. Jamal and Kalu. The masons of Jagruti School said 
that their grandfathers used many different kind of bricks. Some of these are given in this photo. There is a photograph given here on page number 10 with different kinds of bricks in it. Which of these bricks have curved edges? How many faces do you observe of the longest brick? Is there any brick which has more than six faces? Find out the size of a brick. Have you observed bricks of different sizes? Take one brick and measure it. A. How long is it? Dash. B. How wide is it? Dash. C. How high is it? Dash. Munya wants to make a wall one meter long. How many bricks will she need to put in a line? Dash. Bricks and bricks. Hot and fresh. Ganesh and Sahiba live near a kiln where bricks are made. There is a picture given here on page number 10 of a kiln. Kiln is a place where bricks are made. Can you guess how high is the chimney here? Is it? A. About 5 meters. B. About 15 meters. C. About 50 meters. Page number 11. Ganesh and Sahiba love to observe the pattern of bricks in the long, long lines kept out to dry. They also observe how bricks are made. There is a picture given here on page number 11 of the long lines kept outside to dry. These lines are of bricks being made in a kiln. Here are the four pictures from the brick kiln. These pictures are jumbled up. Observe them carefully. Write the correct order. Dash. There are four pictures given here from a brick kiln. They have been marked as A, B, C and D. Different phases of the brick building process have been given in these four pictures. You have to identify the correct order and write in the blank space given here. How do you think a brick is made out of soil dug from the earth? Observe the pictures and discuss in groups. Page number 12 Have you seen a brick kiln? Did you try to guess the number of bricks kept there? There are many, many brick kilns in India. Thousands of them. More than 100,000. Can you imagine how big this number is? This number is also called 1 lakh. Can you try to write it? Ask your friends where they have heard of a lakh. Find out. Observe these photos and guess how many bricks are carried by this truck. Here on page number 12, two different pictures of a truck carrying bricks are given. Also find out from a truck driver how many bricks they can carry in one truck. Mental Math Bhajan buys bricks Bhajan went to buy bricks. The price was given for 1,000 bricks. The prices were also different for different types of bricks. The different prices for different types of bricks given here are Old bricks, rupees 1,200 for 1,000 bricks. New bricks from Entapur, rupees 1,800 for 1,000 bricks. New bricks from Brikabad, Rupees 2,000 for 1,000 bricks. Bhajan decided to buy the new bricks from Brikabad. He bought 3,000 bricks. How much did he pay? Dash. Guess what he will pay if he buys 500 old bricks. A guesswork has been given here. The ant, symbolizing the guesswork, says, Do this without writing. 
you were just listening to chapter number 1 titled building with bricks ends here narrators shalini singh and webhav shrivastav technical control bati langling do technical assistance vikas sangwan assistance in production jagbandhu jana direction and production vimlesh choudhary This audio book is brought to you by CIET NCERT New Delhi India